What's up, friends? Chuck here, and welcome back to God of War. Oh, all right. It's been a little while since I've played. Um, my computer died. Uh, my hard drive died, and I lost everything, which sucks. So at the moment, I'm working off a, uh, a very, very small SSD. Um, but I want to keep making content, so hopefully I could continue to do so. Um, but if I miss a couple days or a week or something, um, then I hope you understand. But yeah, losing all of my everything... <laughs> Um, sucked ass. Anyway, let's get going. Uh, we do have this mission, uh, Return to Tears Vault, which we're going to do. And we also have Bring the Valkyrie's Helms to the Council. We can do that, however, we can't seem to fast travel with this yet, even though Brock said that we could. So I don't really understand that. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> now we can. Uh, so let's do that then, right? Let's go to... We can't go to the witch's cave, which is where we are. So we can't go out to get that treasure, which is irritating because I really want to do that. Uh, but where is Council of the Valkyries? There it is. Let's do it. The fact that we can fast travel now is... Well, it's kind of explain that how good that is. So backtracking now hey, will be a lot easier. A god. Maybe I can fly. No, no! Gods too must stay on the path, I promise you. So, Odin wants to go where he can't reach. Are you saying he's trying to get to Jotunheim too? Aye, it ranks among his foremost obsessions. But, that doesn't make any sense, Vimir. Oh? When did I stop making sense? Hmm. You're saying Baldur tracked us down to find the way to Jotunheim. But that was before we knew Jotunheim is where we needed to go. That's crazy. Except for one thing, you are headed for Jotunheim, so he was right. I'm so confused. Well then, clearly you've been listening. <laughs> I mean, I'm a bit confused, to be honest. If Odin and Baldir were trying to get to Jotunheim, and they think we are the answer, how did they know that before we knew that we had to go there? Mimir insists this makes sense. Yeah. Uh, okay, so if you guys can remember any where backtracking thing, uh, where we can use the red... Um, the lightning arrows on the red shit. We can now get rid of that bramble stuff. Uh, we can now use those little balls. Any of that stuff? Let me know. I remember one uh, with the balls. Oh, and also the um, the magic doors. I remember where there's a ball and a magic door. So we'll go there in a sec. But we've got two Valkyries dead. This is it, right? The rock stall? I lied. The Council of Valkyries. The Valkyries are of Valhalla, are they not? Glad to see you're paying attention, brother. You are correct. Valhalla, the great hall of the Ain Heriar, is their home within Asgard. But while there, they are subject to the scrutiny of the Allfather himself. And relations between the Valkyries and Odin were... tense during my tenure as his advisor. Why? Well, that's an even longer story, lad. For now, why don't we look around for some clues? I agree. Place the Eight Helms. Okay, so there's Eight Valkyries. Place the eight helms makes sense. This is kind of Dark Soulsy, right? The Lords of Cinder and all that good stuff. So let's do it. I don't think there's a particular order or anything. You just put them down wherever you want. I wonder if we get rewarded for each one. Turns out we probably do. Come here. Who is she? Gunnar, Mistress of War. After any conflict, big or small. Okay, maybe instead of Gunnar, Mistress of War. After any conflict, okay, so we're totally cutting him off. Uh, any conflict, big or small, she would be the first on the scene sussing out the worthy spirits for a free trip to Valhalla. A gruesome task, but she took great pride in it. Her judgment of the fallen was unparalleled and an invaluable resource to Odin. She was one of his favourites. Ooh, golden child. Golden child. She would be first on the scene sussing out the worthy spirits for a free trip to Valhalla. A gruesome task. She took great pride in it. Any conflict impossible it's true she had help from her sisters of course but gunnar was always first to arrive her judgment of the fallen was unparalleled and an invaluable resource to odin she was one of his favorites i think she was also uh the first one to die so you know first in worst dressed i guess This, my friends, is Kara. Now, Valkyries are volatile by nature, but Kara, the lass is wild storm personified. 
A wild storm. Aye, calm and collected. Then the air would shift and the fury of our storm would unleash. It was beautiful in a way, assuming you could find proper shelter. <laughs> our tears would cleanse the blood-soaked battlefields. Alright, well, we didn't really get rewarded, so to speak. Um, I think we probably got some XP or something, but uh, I don't know. Two down, six to go, it's not too bad. Let us... Go to this place I'm thinking of. Um, it was where we first met Sindri. Where that is... Me no no. Alright. Let's have a think. Elfheim Ram Tower? No. Elfheim? No. 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 The Mason's Channel? No. Where Where was it that we first met Sindri? Rune, runes of the Ancient? I have no idea. We, we had to then go up the mountain, right? We had to go up the mountain. And there was the black shit. And we needed, um... The thingamajiggy to get there. So... Going up the mountain, maybe it's here? Ruins of the... I'm gonna go here and see if that's it. Because remember, there was, um... There was all those poison pool things. Um... Okay. And then... Tell me again how Odin knew we were going to Yodenheim before we... Hold that thought. Odin is extremely clever, you see. Nearly as clever as he thinks he is. And he's a collector of prophecies. If it's about the future, he adds it to his collection. Helps him style himself as all-seeing and all-knowing. But of course, the idea is control. Control of the future, control of his fate. He'd control every realm of every land in every world if he could. Every potential pocket of resistance, he seeks to eliminate. Even if you've never posed a threat before, he may think one day you might. So you see, it's not important how he knew before you did. It's important that he was right. Right, eh? Whoa. Odin's uh, collects prophecies. Tied to control... Tries to control fate by knowing the future. Maybe he thinks we'll pose a threat someday, or at least he knows we're looking for a way to get at night. Right, eh? Is this where I think it is? It is not. It's not at all. Um, well, shit. Because remember there was the poison pools, right? Uh, we, we met Sindri and then there was a bunch of wolves and there was poison pools and then we went through those poison pool thingies and there was a revenant there and we killed that and then there was some more poison pools and there was a uh, winds of hell there and there was a mirrored door there. I remember that. I just don't remember where it was. And it was definitely... Past there was... Climbing the mountain. So I assume... It's... It's not near the dead giant. But if we're climbing a mountain, it's got to be... Here somewhere, right? The Mason's Channel? Here, maybe? Was it Wildwood Edge? The mines? Man, I don't even know. <laughs> Stone Falls? I mean, I assume... The Mason's Channel. I assumed it was here. Because that's going up a mountain. I mean, there's multiple mountains though. There is the mountain. <sighs> okay, let's go to... Let's go to these mines. I don't think it's this. And if it's not that, we'll just continue on with the story. And maybe we'll find it somehow. I don't know. But if you guys remember, it's where we first met Sindri, if that helps. I'm here. What else did the serpent tell you when you spoke? 
Kinda sounded important. I'm sure it's nothing. He just said the boy seemed familiar to him. Me? That's impossible. Don't I quite agree. Unless, perhaps, he refers to something yet to be. It is said that when Jormungandr and Thor battle at Ragnarok, their clash so violently shakes the Tree of Life that it splinters, casting the Serpent backward through time, even before his own birth. What? That is madness. <laughs> it well, is spot. I did say not to concern yourself. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Um... Jormanda. Your, your Mangander? I don't know. I can't remember how he pronounced it. And the World Serpent have already fought Thor in Ragnarok. And he was knocked back in time to now. That or Mimir is insane. I mean, both could be right. It does like a ramble. Is this it? Where, where is this? This is not it. Alright, screw it. Let's give up on that. So we need to go to Tears, um... Tears thingy, right? Is there a waypoint for that on the map? As far as... Yeah, okay, we gotta go back here. The journey. So we'll go back to Mystic Gateway. Brock's shop. I guess. That, that waypoint looks like it's, um... The boat. In which case, we could have got on the boat anyway. I guess we're getting all this, um... Do you know why there are no more giants left in Midgard? All like this story out of the way. The serpent from the future? Well, they did not take me into their confidence about that. Odin's convictions to the contrary. But I know this. If I'd spent the better part of 60 winters seeing my best and brightest cut down by Thor and that damn hammer, I might very well go home to lick my wounds. It's too bad. I was fond of every giant I ever met. So that's why they destroyed the bridges to Jotunheim. So the Acer couldn't fall. And is that why there's no tower on the lake? I doubt it's a coincidence. So you think when we get to Jotunheim, we might find giants there? Anything's possible. Well, yeah, I guess. All right. It is the land of the giants. The giants left Midgard to escape Thor's slaughter. Most likely, um, their work destroying the bridges to travel there. Why did they? What did they take? Sorry. What did they do to make Jotunheim Tower in the lake? disappear. Well, I'm assuming we'll find out. Okay, I don't think we need to talk to Brock. Has he got a little dialogue? He does not. Let's move on. This, this seems like it's just taking us to the boat. It definitely is. Okay, that's a bit odd. We could have got a boat anyway, but it's fine. We're here now. No, it is definitely not. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember now. I'd forgotten about this, to be honest. Use the sound ball. Before we do that, we didn't check down here last time. Is this going to be the opening on the other side? Okay, well. That was somewhat lackluster. Oh well. Sandball it is. Here we go again. Do it. Read it. Death itself I swallow to spring forth life tomorrow. Oh, I like that one. It's like Jumanji. I wonder if I wrote it. <laughs> go on. Write it. Write it. Anytime. Anytime. Um. <laughs> Cratelet, you wanna? Is this another thing that I'm gonna get confused about that's super obvious? Um. That I just didn't pay attention to. Because I did not pay attention to what he said. Something about swallowing death. What's going on? Is it bugged? 
it seems like it's bugged. Okay, I'm gonna go out the door and gonna come back in because that that doesn't seem right. Unless I'm meant to come back out here, which I don't think I am. Wait, let's go back up and see if that actually did anything. Because it says it's that way, but it might be up here. But I, it's it's definitely not. No. Alright, back in that room. I hope it's not another obvious thing that I'm, I'm getting confused about. Although it's, it's... Here we go again. Here we go again. Exactly. All right. Do it, man. Do it. You can do it. I believe in you. Read it. Death itself I swallow to spring forth life tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I like that one. I wonder if I wrote it. Oh, my God. Is that the answer there? <sighs> Says Earth. Hmm. Swallows death, brings forth life. Go. Yeah. That's obvious. Why wouldn't it just do that automatically? I wish so I'd known I was a god in Elfheim. I wouldn't have felt so bad about killing so many elves. Well, I'm not sure that's the lesson. You've done nothing to regret. That's right. The elves forced their lives upon us. That's right. No, I get it now. We had god things to do. That's right. And they were in the way. That's right. Dragging us into their little problems. That's right. Again, are we just leaving that there? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Maybe you feel a little too good right now. <laughs> With power comes a big choice, lad. You can either serve yourself or put your godhood in the service of others, like Tyr did. People really loved him, huh? Aye. A god of war. That's me. But one who fought for peace. Oh. Had a reputation for being heroic and lawful, using his power and knowledge to stop wars rather than start them. So there are good gods. Once in a moon, it's been known to happen, yes? Okay, well, he didn't comment on that mural. This one mentions places I've never heard of. Okay. Seems Tia really liked to travel. Tia believed the mind, not the mind, was key to preventing war and chaos. And he also knew visiting other cultures would give him perspective staying in one place could not. While Odin always hoarded knowledge, guarding it jealously, Tia was open and sharing with his learning and his wisdom. For this, mortals adored Tia. Showing their love by bringing him gifts the world over. I like gifts. Who doesn't love free shit? So, whatever happened to Tyr? Odin came to regard him as a threat to his rule. He suspected Tyr of collaborating to aid the giants instead of helping to steal their secrets for the Aesir. No, oh, no. Same thing he accused me of, frankly. Though in Tyr's case, I believe he was right. You think Tyr was helping the giants? I do. He felt responsible for the suffering visited upon them by Odin. I suspect he had something to do with helping them cover their tracks. The missing Jotunheim Tower. Correct. Whatever happened to it, I believe it could only have been done with Tyr and the Giants working together. Retrieve the Black Rune. Alright, shit, let's do it. Where is this Black Rune head? Oh, no, I've never been in here. Oh, this looks cool. The stone. That has to be it. Mm, shit, it's pretty fancy. Okay, there's gonna be enemies, surely. Oh. Naturally. All right. Well. Here comes. Didn't think it would be that easy. No. Just kind of hoping though. Deactivate the vault's so defenses. Well, right now we've got to deactivate the vault's defenses, right? You didn't hear the little bang update. Rather a trap for the winds of hell. But where do you think the winds are? The winds of what? Oh, we forgot to mention that. When you were sick, we went to Hellheim to get your cure. Oh yeah, he shit. Did? He doesn't know. Terrible experience, by the by. Your dad picked up a new trick with a little help from Brock. Brock was there too? Brock's always there. Okay, but... We'll get back to this later. <laughs> okay, can we go in any of these doors? Doesn't look like it. Okay, 
they're really good for smashing pods. Um, so it looks like there's just that one area, which was over here. Okay, um, 3,019. Not too bad. Not too bad. Okay, so here's a wind of hell bullshit. There's also some rats. I can hear rats. I can hear something rat-like. Alright. Boy. Ah, a ski and do from my homeland. Used to have one of Owen back in the day. You should take it, boy. Yes, boy. Take it. We might need to butter bread somewhere in our travels. <laughs> this is why no one likes you. Oh, <laughs> uh, shit. Okay, well, we got a new dagger, I guess. That's pretty cool. Um, we can now butter bread, which is also cool. Okay. Can I... Okay, again, can go through that door, which is nice. We have to activate this. Which we cannot do because uh, we need the, the active open wind of hell to be able to prop that. So, let's see what we can see. We can see... Jack Dilly yeah. Bob Kiss. We can see... Okay, we can see this. Okay, that's a bit awkward. Okay. That... Didn't... Do anything? Oh, hang on. Oh, it's so hard to see. Okay, let's just do that one. Right. Now if I spin this again. Does that do anything? Come on. You can do it. I wish you could duck. It would make things a lot easier. There we go. No, that did not do anything. Okay. This is so awkward. Um, this just looks like it's to get a chest, so this may be pointless in the end. I'm guessing that's what it is, because now we have access to that chest. I don't think there's anything else for that. Is there a wind of hell out here that we can access? There is. Okay. So that's the first step. Smack this bad boy. Missed it. Got it. Move it or you may lose it, brother. I'm moving it, dude. I am moving it. I have moved it. Atreus, you wanna say something? Atreus does not give a fuck about our tricks, man. He just doesn't care. I mean oh. Okay, that's now moving. Where's the one that we did? Okay, that's still stationary. Um, we got some fancy knives. Couldn't care less. We just did some shit he's never seen before. Couldn't care less. He's just happy that he can butter bread, I think. Well, that's unfriendly. Okay, let's go get this one. How'd you know that was there? Experience. Sp yeah, Spartan, Spartan. Nice. Okay, so now we've got to play. Look, the old passages on either side. Ooh. Ooh. Catholic for the boy. It's just not the father. Though. Yeah, it's so. I will be fine. We've got to play um, Indiana Jones in the Last Crusade. Ow, ow, ow. Careful, brother. 
Rhea's not here to bring you back if you're cutting too. Okay, we need to make room. Okay, never mind, we did it. Careful. Is it another dagger? Can we butter like crumpets now? Or bagels? Or muffins? Oh, there we go. It's the Holy Grail. Um. Would you just drink random shit that you found? No, you would not. Well, there's us. <clears throat> the music's really good in that. Uh, What'd you shit. find? Oh. Enough distraction. Do not forget why we are here. Okay. So he broke it before Atreus could see. Even though he knows he's a god, I guess he... Oh no. Never mind. Okay, first things first. Let's get some health. Because... We did, uh, chop ourselves quite a bit. Okay, there's another thing I can axe. Oh! Oh! I don't know what that's for or where it is, but I'm happy I found it. Wait, did that just activate this? It did, it activated something in here. Oh, there's number... Oh, no, maybe not. Okay, well... We got one rune. And one rune's better than no runes. <laughs> um, Alright, there was a, a square here. There's also a door. Is that the door we came in? No, we came through there, right? Okay, well, let's... Let's do the square. That's from a great desert land very far from here. It's like a scarab. Do gods live there? Oh my, yes. Many, many gods. Good or bad? And not as simple as that, I'm afraid. God damn it, Atreus! Hold it still, dude. I can't get it. I can't... Is he still holding it? No, he's put it back. What the hell was it? It kind of looks like a scarab. I don't know. Uh... Just looking for runes is all. Alright, well, let's go through this door, I guess. Well, shit. Well, double shit. Okay, 
Okay, did we do it? Oh we did it. <coughs> Pardon me. What did you see in that vault? Uh, okay, using R2, Axel, will freeze them and bring them down to Earth. Or we could just shoot them. Yeah, here we go. My arrows can stun them, which will allow Fata to finish them off. If he grabs them while stunned, he can throw them at other enemies and they'll explode. I set you off. Which we know. Sweet. It is not important. It's even important to you. It was a rash impulse. You need not dwell on my failings. Is he gonna come alive? Wow. I feel like he's gonna come alive. An apology. Well, I guess you do like to smash Fata. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, uh, I don't think we'll be able to get up there yet. I like that they they made mention of smashing pottery. That's Stands to good. reason the second ring should behave like the first. Yep. Just need to capture the winds. Yep, it is true. Then we're going to need to come through here. Oh shit, it's not that door. Let's find out which door it is. Is it going to be here again? Oh, I guess so. So this is going to open up a different door, maybe? Enough? Enough. Okay, let's try again. Where is it? It's going to come around. There it is. Nailed it. Double nailed it. So this this has to be a different room. Thinking about it. Look. They all it all I just turned around. Okay. I don't care if it hurts me or not. I want to learn. Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. This. That's where we came from, I think. Right, that just connects to where we were. It has to, because there's that... Uh, we better check. Oh, oh. shit. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, okay, it is. It's totally the same place. So... It all looks the same. You get turned around a bit. Well, I do at least. So now we have that open to us and this open to us. And we're looking for runes as well. So keep that in mind. Okay, let's go here first. Why not? More small passages. I know. Go. I can't watch, brother. Good luck. Tanks. Alright. I mean, we got this. It's like right here. We did it. And I thought those saws were scary. That was nothing. That was like the pisses of piss. That was like... Bear Grylls would drink his own... Would drink that own piss. Uh, I'm gonna go... I'm going to quickly go back. Because there was that other way. And I want to check what's there. I knew that was bad as soon as I did it. <laughs> uh, God of wall sandwich. Oh man, we're all the way back here. Really? 
Oh, we have to f do that fight and everything? Is he going to talk about the Scarab again? No, the Scarab is in has been talked about. Okay, do we have to do this fight again? No. We do not. So where where are we up to? We have we just gotta use this. Look, All right. I just wanna know the truth for now. Okay? I don't care if it hurts me or not. I want to learn. Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. Yes. Okay, we're gonna have to fight. Damn it. We're gonna have to freeze this bad boy. Is that another one? I feel like there was a second one in there. Okay, there was not. Well, why am I picking it back up like an idiot? It was, I was seeing this from behind. Okay, so two runes down. That's good. I guess. More small passages. I know. Go. I can't watch, brother. Good luck. I did it. And I thought those saws were scary. Look! It's the wolf giants. Skull and Hati. That's right. The bringers of day and night. Ragnarok begins when they catch the sun and moon. Right? <laughs> did Tyrna them? I don't know. Like them well enough to cover a massive wall in his vault with them, though. It's true. Okay, so this will go out to the main area. And another fight ensues, no doubt. Don't you enjoy it at all? Being a god? Maybe not. On an adventure in some amazing place? Well, let's Maybe do the last ring. Us to have a little fun. Everything we've seen and done. Maybe it was her gift. Uh, where's the thingy? I, I need the thingy. I don't see another trap for the, uh... Winds of Hell? Yeah. Maybe we can get up to one of those balconies for a better look. Oh, okay. Now that's open. Sweet. Good, good, good. Where was it? Here. Wait, is it? Oh, okay. I thought we could go up further, but this tree root was there. But I think we can go across instead. Yeah, okay, nice. Come on, get the angle. Get the angle. No, look right, buddy. Look, Ugh, come on. No, not up. To the right. To the left? It's not to the left. Is it up? Oh, it's up. Oh, dur, 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 dur. Spamming lightning arrows is basically the best thing. I hear more nightmares, I think. I don't know where they are. Did you hit it? Oh shit, they're all the way over there. Okay. 
Oh. I think that's about it. Oh, is that a chest? Well, it is, but we can't get to it. Father can hit them twice on the same axe throw. Once it throw and then once on the recoil. Yeah, or you could just shoot them. Which works out amazingly well. And is probably way easier. Because uh, apparently I'm not the best at aiming. Alright, so here's the... Oh, we'll get this this uh, chain. Don't go down. Damn it. You know, for someone so loved, Tear sure was paranoid. Ah, uh, thanks to Odin, with good reason. Okay, so we still can't see the thing we need to see. Or is that it there? No. Is it? I don't think it is, because it's the third ring we need, right? We can't see it. Let's go down and see what that did, if anything. Because it said go up to get a better look on a balcony. We're just on the wrong angle, I guess. This is just a shortcut back down. Uh, I doubt we're going to be able to get down this chain in 10 seconds and get to the room, which I can't even remember what di um, what direction it is. So let's... Okay, there's the thing. Look, there's the wind trap. Uh, okay, I know. So we get the wind trap. Chuck it on that bad boy, and then we do it from downstairs. Clever. Yep. Yep. Alright, well, let's leave it here. When we come back, we'll do the Winds of Hell bullshit and continue through uh, Tears Bajiggity and uh, find out what's going on. And hopefully, we can find that last rune. Um, if not, oh, wait, hold on. We're gonna have to do some searching. So, next episode might be like 20 minutes of searching for a rune. Let's hope not, but could be. Let's read this quickly then. What of these? Thought is faster than wind. Ah, a timely hint for something we've figured out ourselves. <laughs> Thought is faster than wind. Tears testing our minds in here. Okay. Hopefully the last rune is in that, um... Last rune is in that room. We shall see. Either way, we'll leave it here. Uh, hopefully you're enjoying it. As always, thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. If you like this video, click here to see another one just like it. If you're new to the channel and like what I'm doing, click here to subscribe and become the newest member of the Chicken Coop. If you really like what I'm doing, you can find a link to my Patreon in the description, where you can help support me and help the channel grow. You'll also find a link to the channel's Discord server where you can chat with me and other members of the Chicken Coop. And don't forget to hit that notification bell!